Good Natured Family Farms is an alliance of 75 family farms surrounding the Kansas City metro area. We sell locally owned, locally operated, independent supermarkets. Good Natured Family Farms, honey. The one and only from local bees and flowers. And it's good, too. True, true, true. That's called facing. Too deep. How are you? Oh, I broke my foot, man. Oh, bummer. Terrible, terrible drive. Percy, how you doing, buddy? Doing good. How are you? How about that Good Nature Family Farm cheese? You want some of that? Local artisan cheese, Good Nature Family Farms. Vince, how are you, buddy? All natural Good Nature Family Farms, Black Angus. So to Vince, number one meat man in Kansas City. <laughs> what have you been up to? Uh, just working. Yeah? I all of bought a little over $100,000 worth last year, 12 months time. They're good people to deal with, you know, they pay good. They're really, really fine people. Of course, they just started out, I mean, I think Balls is about like our honey house. I think Fred Balls' dad, I'm sure he was, had one little old store in Kansas City in the early 1900s. You know, now they've got, I think, 34 of them, and they keep it growing, so, you know, he knows what it's like to be little, because they started off that way. When we started our relationship with Diane Endicott uh, five years ago, she had brought this concept of, of putting together a co cooperative of different farmers, and um, we pretty much, on a handshake, uh, tell them we're going to take everything that they grow. and so. Uh, being a small family-owned company, we're able to do that. We see it as really good for our customers because we're giving them the best possible products available on the face of the earth. How you doing, buddy? This guy right here is a perfect example. He is actually uh, 95 years old, but he consumes Good Nature Family Farm products, and look how healthy he looks for, <laughs> for a 95-year-old. Huh? <laughs> Oh, I broke my foot. These man. independent supermarkets, they are up against the same thing that the small family farms are. Because every time a Walmart comes in to a rural area, that local grocery store usually goes. Okay. Consolidation is growing at such a rate, not just in the food industry, but in all industries, that probably the first and foremost thing that I truly believe that we're trying to sustain is consumer choice.